And Ethan Sabeau is the uh, testosterone of the week. He's a very blunt and fearless blogger. He's uh, ag- constantly aggregating everything he does uh, everywhere. Twitter, Facebook, everywhere. And he gets a lot of shit all the time and just takes it head on. Very nice guy. He's born and raised in Texas. Oh, I like how he, he redefines or makes shoves it in the in the left spaces of what the actual term for a bigot is. Yeah. All the and time. It's all the time. And he calls them on it constantly. He's extremely relentless for it because and one of the more interesting thing is in uh, in the in the height of the our the Republican primary. He was actually a, a Santorum supporter. So this whole notion that Santorum he doesn't get along with gay people and blah 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 is like no it's you don't it just because you're gay doesn't mean you're not christian well and you can go through his page um he has uh ethan has a whole list of where i stand on the issues sort of thing and he's very clear about it you know he tackles abortion and immigration and taxes and gay marriage and foreign policy he's really thought these things through and and is able to stand there and defend them in, instead of letting people just say uh, you're supposed to fit into this box or that box. I think that's that's incredibly nice that to find somebody you know gay or not who's able to articulate where they stand and then lay it out there and then defend it. Yep, he I, I doubt he would ever run for any office, but if he did, he would most likely win sheerly on his organization and his bluntness. I like him. He's great. I loved his yeah. videos. I watched several of them. Mm-hmm. And he's very in your face. He's almost... He's the conservative that I love. Mm-hmm. The type. Me too. That in your face, balls to the walls. I don't give a shit if you like me or not. This is the way it is. Yep. And I love that he shows up in his pajamas once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> not gonna lie. Yeah. It's cute as no, hell. It's he is a cutie. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm probably going to get to meet him one of these days, just running around through Texas political events. So, ninny ninny boo boo, guys. Ha ha. <laughs> Does anybody know where he lives out in Texas? What area? Uh, the Austin Dallas area. Forward. Yeah, Austin. Dallas area? It, it's Austin, Austin area. I don't remember. <laughs> Which I only go to every other month because my daughter lives there. Oh, okay. Yeah, see, I, I don't keep that close to tabs on where people live because it's kind of their business. Ah. <laughs> uh. What are you saying? <laughs> that I, I don't need to seem like a stalker for knowing someone's address. <laughs> you don't know my address? No, not at all. And I don't Damn need it. to. Damn it. <laughs> you are not loved. I'm telling him. Somebody loves me. Whatever. Anyway, so he's at, our, uh, at um, TGR underscore Ethan Sabo on Twitter. And you should follow him because he does engage. He talks. Yep. He he likes to talk. He likes to exchange. And he does not have a lot of followers, so he needs some love. He does. Everyone who's listening, follow Ethan. We're waiting. What are you waiting for? <laughs> Click it now. I did. I did. 